God wants you to enjoy every single day. And we should enjoy getting up in the morning, enjoy going to work, enjoy your family, enjoy the outdoors, enjoy every part of your day. That's God's dream, but I know too many people that are just dragging through life. They don't like their job. They can't stand the traffic. They don't enjoy their spouse. They are just going through the moments of life, getting up, going to work, coming home. No joy, no enthusiasm. But friends, it doesn't bring any glory to God for us to drag around with a long face, negative, discouraged, treat, wrong out. You need to get up every morning and say with David, this is the day the Lord has made and I am going to enjoy it. We need to make that declaration right at the start of the day. David was saying, in fact, I am not going to focus on what's wrong today. I am going to focus on what's right. I am not going to dwell on what I don't have. I am going to thank God for what I do have you can enjoy every day of your life if you want to battle enough. Trouble in life is inevitable, bad chapter in life are inevitable. Bad sins in the story of your life are inevitable. But misery is a choice, misery is an option. It is your choice, it is not mandatory, it is not required. And I want to encourage you misery and unhappiness are not required. Misery and unhappiness are a choice. And we can't make the choice today to live miserable through our life story or we can live with joy through our life story. We can live in misery or we can live in joy and we can be happy and it is a choice. No one has a power to make you unhappy. No one has the power to control your life. We only give people the power over our lives by the choices we make to wait for them to make us happy or we can choose to be happy. Because God is with us through our toughest time, through our toughest trial and through our life story. Praise the Lord in the comments and like the video. Thank you.